Okay, so the next trick I'm going to show you that you can do with uh, AC Iconia W3 Window 8 tablet is that you can actually hook up a um, internet stick to this tablet and it will work. Now, of course, you have to get um, a service. So I use uh, 7-Eleven Unlimited Internet uh, service. It's only, I think it's a 3G but um, if you hook it up to an internet stick like this one here is Rogers and change some of the configuration um, on the software and on the browser you should be able to co connect it directly so let's have a look if we can uh, serve the web using this internet stick okay so I put the sim card in there that has um, allowed me to serve the web unlimited this is a uh, um, 7-Eleven unlimited internet it cost me only 10 bucks a month right now it's not really unlimited it's actually only 2 gig that allowed because after 2 gig they will actually cancel your service because you're not using it properly okay so it's only 2 gig so hook it up to a uh, USB connector there we go See if we can connect it properly here. There we go. It's done. And then the next thing is now you notice that on my um, Acer I put all these um, what's that called the the Velcro on it so that I can just attach it like that. Okay. So <laughs> it looks funny. It looks really ugly. But like I said, to those who love their tablet being shiny and nice looking I'm not into that I'm into the function so I'm hooking up my internet stick and put a velcro on the back so I can stick my internet stick onto it and there we go okay so the software already um, load up and it's a Nokia internet modem that's what the Roger stick is the internet stick is and then once I hook that up it this software load up and then I just connect it like that now to hook up to the internet, you would need to uh, uh, adjust the software. This Nokia internet modem, you have to go to internet connection. And uh, under internet connection, click on that. And connection profile. And you can see this, the speak out. Uh, um, let's see, speaker, if I can just uh, view that. Let me see if I can look at the information. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's how it's set up. Okay, that's Speak Out 7-Eleven uh, in Canada, in Toronto. And then you just connect to the internet. Now, that's one way, that's just one part of the con uh, configuration that you have to change for the, for the, um, to get the internet to work. So now it's dial in, it's, it's saying that there's uh, um, data streaming back and forth here, in and out. And then I set up my Firefox browser. I'll click on that for you. And I'll show you that it actually works. For example, let's say if I want to search for um, uh, Acer um, Iconia W, that's what this tablet is, 3, tight search. And there we go. It's there it's not worked isn't that cool so basically my um, internet stick as you can see here I hook it up to my um, Acer uh, Iconia W3 and it, I can be going anywhere in uh, that has I can uh, receive this uh, internet through Rogers right or 7-eleven service provider internet service provider I'd be able to uh, check anything I want even watch YouTube but I wouldn't recommend watching YouTube it's pretty slow but for searching, for looking at maps and all that, that this works perfectly. Now, you also have to, in order to um, have this internet set up, you would also have to change the browser as well. So if you go into the um, option in um, your Firefox, you have to go under Advanced. And then under Advanced, uh, the connection, configure how the Firefox connect to the internet setting, and then you have to click on manual proxy configuration, change the HTTP proxy, and that's it. 
um, once you set that for your browser, I choose um, Firefox browser, it works perfectly. Okay, so the internet stick works pretty well. It's hooked up to my tablet, the uh, Ace Iconia W3, and I can search on Wikipedia. I can search on a news channel like uh, Five, uh, Fox News. I can search Google. Okay, instant information. Amazing. Using the internet stick hooked up to my uh, Iconia uh, W3, uh, Windows Tablet 8. This device is so versatile. You can hook up a lot of Windows compatible devices and it works quite well. Okay. So I have the SIM card I bought from 7-Eleven. I uh, mod it, change a bit of the configuration, and able to, you know, run an internet. So I can pretty bit much be anywhere, and uh, don't have to be in McDonald's or other type of uh, place where you have access to internet. I could be on the road and still check my internet, and it costs me only ten dollars a month, unlimited internet access. Amazing. Thank you.